Hey everybody. Welcome to Sunday. <clears throat> Welcome to another Sunday. It's another Sunday. Another Sunday. Welcome to another Sunday. We've made it. We've all made it to another Sunday. Hey Red Dwarf. Hey Navichek. Can we fix the plumbing today? I sure hope so. I don't, actually, I don't think the plumbing's broken. No, there could be plumbing broken. It's more about managing the plumbing than fixing it. Got my maps here. Got my maps all printed out here. I like this game. Hi, Henfu. I guess some people don't like this game, but it's actually a pretty good game. When you think about it, in general. Uh, you just have to approach it from the right angle. And I wasn't doing that at first, so it was kind of hard at first. I was also really tired the first day I started this. You gotta approach this from the right angle. This game is a puzzle to be solved. The entire game is a puzzle. So it- and the map and the moving around the map is part of the puzzle, so if you're not on top of that, you're gonna get lost. You're gonna feel bad, you're gonna feel sick. Hey Zesty Moon. The main quest is to make the water flow into the toilet so you can take a dump and leave, <laughs> and leave the island. I hope... No, that's not it. I'm not sure what game you've been watching, Navichek. But I wish there was a... I hope there's a game like that. So last time uh, we played, we couldn't get into this elevator. Knock, knock. Hi, Syllogism. We couldn't get into this elevator. Now, this is the only thing that I haven't liked about this game so far. Uh that the way you get into this, make this button work. When we exited the elevator on the other side of it, you have to turn around and then there's a button that rotates it. So I did that off stream. I just ran back to it and rotated it. Hey, Infinity Issue. Did I finish Dragon Lore 2? I did not. Uh, that game is impossible to finish. Even I cannot finish Dragon Lore 2, sadly. Uh, they made that game impossible to finish. <laughs> it's it's impossible to play that game. Everything about that game is bad. Now, I don't mind a bad game, but a game has to be possible to play. They just made the interface so bad. Hi, Amberzine. So now we're doing Rem, and I actually like this game. I think it's on to on uh, on the whole, it's a it's a good game. But if you're not on top of that map, you're gonna you're gonna have a bad time. So now we're on to a new area. We'll try to finish this game today. I think it's possible. Um, there's a mathematical proof the game is impossible to play. I agree. There's also non-mathematical proof. I still have a sore throat, so I have to eat lozenges. I have to eat lozenges the whole stream. My wife says I don't need to go see the doctor, so I trust my wife. Um, here we go. What did I just do? Why did I go back up? It's fun to go up and down in an elevator. The interface on Dragon Lord 2 is just so bad. Like, it's like, uh, they didn't, they never made a game before or something. Open up! Okay, now we're on this side of the island here. I like this game. I, I want to play this whole series. Not in a row. We're not going to play this whole series in a row. Now, the thing with the turning around and then tur you turning around the elevator, that's definitely a callback to Riven, where you have to turn around and, like, close doors and stuff. So I can forgive it. I'm not mad at it. I like this game. Yes, okay, good. We rotated that. Oh, so now we're going through that tunnel where we had to rotate this thing and rotate it back so we could go through this. Otherwise, we'd have to go all the way back and rotate that back. Hi, Evans Cloud. Moms have doctor skills? Well, also, my wife is in the medical field. So, I trust her. She's always like... <laughs> like, I used to... <laughs> I used to have a, um... I used to get, like, con or sometimes I get congested at night. So I started taking, like, a decongestant every night. And she was like, no, you can't do that. That's unhealthy. So she helps me. Helps me stay alive. Hi, Gusak, and hi, Heaven's Cloud. Apparently you're not supposed to take a decongestant every night because it has something to do with meth. Like, it's similar to meth. She said- I think she said that. I- maybe I wasn't paying close attention. Hope this ends with a new guy coming to Rem. Syllogism, how is it gonna end? There's no cars. 
<laughs> that would be great if you solve the uh, island and it just sends a new guy in, you take his car and then leave. How are we going to leave? I mean, we could solve the mystery of Ram, but... I mean, maybe there's a ship, like, when you solve the... When you find the, all the fragments. Okay. What am I looking at here? What is this? What is this mess? It looks like a fan or something. Okay. Maybe there's a rocket ship when you solve the island, and then you take a rocket into space. And you become Buzz Aldrin. You're, and, then it, and then you look down at your shirt, and the tag on it says Buzz Aldrin. Is that where the radio frequency thing was, or whatever that was? I didn't miss a path, did I? Hey, Defying Zero, how's it going? Welcome to the world of REM. The mysterious world of REM. It's a puzzle. This game is a puzzle. My wife is poisoning me with rat poison. I don't think she would go to those lengths to get rid of me. But you never know, Red Dwarf. Actually, that you bring up a good point. You can never trust anyone. So therefore, always assume everyone is trying to poison you. It's a good, it's a good way to live. Oh, I love these noises. There's so many closed door noises and negative beeps. Okay. Well, what, what, what do we got here? Nope. Honk. <laughs> Honk. Hey, drunk newbie, especially your wife. You can never trust your wife. Hank. I, I love hearing this noise. Because I just imagine, like, that's the horn of a one of those forklifts you drive... One of those little forklifts you drive around a warehouse. <laughs> Can't get enough of that noise. New, new sub alert. You don't trust even yourself not to poison yourself. Well, that's the best way to live. That's the best. Look at that over there. I see that. We need to get through that door. We need to get through that other door. Alright. We gotta make sure we look around here. I don't want to miss a thing. Just like you know who. Arrowsmith. Just like Arrowsmith. I don't want to miss a thing in this game. I think he was talking about his daughter's life. I'm talking about... Rem 1, Special Edition. Two very close examples. Those are very close to each other. Shrademan, thank you for that host. Playing Conan Exiles. Alright, I hear you can see naked people parts in that game. And that makes me want to play it. <laughs> hey, Kilby. Welcome, Kilby. Welcome to Rem, Kilby. Ooh, another... Maybe this is the rocket ship you blast off in when you solve the game. How you doing, Kilby? Kilby! You would probably like this game, because you like hard puzzle games, right? You would probably like this game, because this is a hard puzzle game inspired by Riven. And it's pretty cool. I think it's pretty cool. I'm not sure if I want to hit this yet. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, I just turned it on. I think that just turns it on. But we're not we're not sure. It might not. I'm going to go check the... Uh, I'm going to go see where the ladder goes. You gotta be thorough in this game, okay? This is the world of Rem. We're solving the puzzle of this island. It's an island puzzle. I like how Mist created the genre of an island that's a puzzle. I hit the big red button. I'll hit any button I want, or no one can stop me. Except my wife. Oh crap! Oh no, am I gonna have to go raise the water again? Alright, we got a water path here. I hope I don't have to go back with all the other I'll go back to all the old pipes. I want to do new stuff. I don't want to go back to old water pipes and raise them. Okay. Hey, Devil. You, you like Conan Exiles, huh, Devil? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I really want to see some of those naked people in Conan Exiles. <laughs> you think the word miss should be banned? Well, this isn't rhombusx.com. This is retrogradetom.com where the word mist is celebrated and the series of mist is celebrated and I'm and I'm not a coward and I'm not a coward like Rhombus X Rhombus X would never play mist many streamers on Twitch would never play mist because they're cowards so this is not a coward's channel we don't do things like ban game ban the term mist or ninjas let Rem stand on its own Stand 
and in the place where you were. What do you guys think this does? Let's take a look at it. Let's focus on it. Let's try to think about what it's doing. Now face west. Think about direction. <laughs> Why you had it now. So what I would guess is that this is preventing this from rising. So we're going to want to maybe prevent it from rising sometimes. But other times, let it rise. Yeah. Also, do not visit RetrogradeTom.com. A scammer took that site and is using it to spread viruses in my name. I, I am not the one doing that. And they want me to spend $1,400 to get it back. And I don't have that kind of money. Oh, a new, a new negative noise. A new metal noise. Mist is hard. Well, that's because you got to have bravery tone. But no, not many streamers on Twitch have bravery. In fact, there's only one, and his name is me. Mist copied Rem? I don't think so, Rhombus. I think this came out in the early 2000s. And Mist came out in, like, 1993. Hey, Ziggles, retroviruses? Well, if they were, that'd be fine. All right, we're not getting anywhere here. Huh. Okay, so I guess the only point was to undo that, so we can raise. Then we'll go do some, go find somewhere we can do something with some waters. Okay. Standing. Oh, it's still on. Oh, this is gonna be a a, a car to ride around in. I can tell. Hold on, let's go. Let's just go look out. Oh, I can't because there's brick walls. All right. Backwards. No, we're gonna break. We're gonna burn out the motor. Let it rise. Uh, you have Sudoku's for breakfast, Kilby. Is that true? Invent a better domain name. I gotta change my name. I don't know who names their child me. Crazy people. All right, we can't. We can't stop in the middle. Okay. We gotta turn it on first. Okay, got it. And nothing out that window. Nothing out that porthole. Okay, so back previously, there's two doors we couldn't get in. And then uh, there's also a floating platform that we might want to go up. I should I should really be writing this down. Or taking pictures or something. Okay, now what do we got here? What does that do? Maybe that calls it? If it's not here? Like it'll call it to here? What else would this do? I'm guessing this is a call button. Not really sure what that is. That's angering me. I'm starting to get mad. Can't. S nope, you cannot stop that animation. Like, you can't get off in the middle and find a secret. We're looking for three letters. We're looking for three letters here. I gotta write down two doors, two doors, and a floating plat. I just don't know what I'm gonna forget. I don't trust myself. Get a food taster. Hey, Nat Belmont, how you doing? Welcome to the world of REM. The mysterious puzzle world of REM. It's a pretty cool game. I like how I'm on the diagonal. It's as if, uh, as if when you're ascending stairs, your whole body is also slanted. I don't think that's how it works, but I forgive you, developer of REM. I think you would still be upright. <laughs> you wouldn't be leaning. All right, wow, so we got, okay, we got four paths here, a bunch of doors. This looks like a fun place to play. But by the way, REM is a sewage treatment plant, and you gotta try to figure out how to escape. Or you gotta try to figure out how to get hired. Then they'll give you the keys to the place, then you can just go around, do whatever you want. All right, so we went west here, we went west. Let's go up here. This looks like a good dead end to check. <gasps> oh, that's just like those shapes we saw before. We saw a little thing that showed us uh, shapes like this. Okay, so we're probably going to have to put in shapes on this for that unlock this door. It's door locked. Hey, Joe. Tooters and a floater. Sorry. I walked downstairs. I'm supposed to walk down diagonally. Hey, shark balls. What puzz whizzing is happening? This is the world of REM. Shark balls. Oh, here we go. Okay. One, two, three, four. That's that room. That's the... Oh, jeez. 
Okay, so, oh, alright, alright. So maybe we're gonna have to put in symbols on all the walls and then hit this button and then we're gonna be like, good. But we gotta figure out what, what symbols to put. Oh, the main character could be in a wheelchair, that's right. But, but this is not a ramp, so it still doesn't make sense. No, it is a miss, like, yeah, Nat Balon. This is inspired by Riven, as far as I know. It's a, it's a, a, a difficult puzzle game. The whole game is a puzzle. Yeah, there's another one here. So yeah, I've got to uh, figure out what to put in on all those panels. Ram, stand in the place where you were. Now face west. Okay, now we got a ladder. Jeez, another ladder. We got to drain the water. <laughs> this game has so many denied sound effects. Most of them involve the sounds you from one of those little forklifts. I like to imagine. Oh, oh god. Holy. Holy god. Holy god in heaven. Okay. Alright. Okay, hold on. First. Things first, man. Hey, chameleon. How are you? Happy New Year. Happy New Year to everyone. Hope you guys are having a... Oh, wait, that's a... Oh, okay, I see. I see what's going on here. Hang on, I don't want to do this right now. I'm not in the mood for this one. Not not in the mood for this right now. We're going to go back. Okay, we're going to quick click here. All right. I wanted, I don't want to do that. That's the door. Happy... How's your guys' year going? I'm having a pretty good year. Had a daughter. That's pretty much it. You have the six CD version of Ribbon. Oh, I only have the digital version. Wait, I, I actually think I have the CD version. Too. Alrighty. I think that's in that bunch of PC games I got recently. We both own something similar, Nat. We have a lot in common. Wait a second. Looked like there was a thing here. No, just a railing, okay. We're going over here first. Sometimes this game flashes, I'm sorry, there's nothing I can do about it. This looks like a weird... It looks like Mist, but it doesn't have any story. It's all puzzle. It's 100% puzzle. It has a tiny fraction of a story. Wait, how... I'm back where we started. Wait, how is this... Hold on. Is this back... We're back where we started? This is where the car was. Oh, this is where the car was, and now we can go through. Oh. Okay. I really need to... Hopefully we see a map of this area soon. I don't think we have a map of this area. So now we can go through because we moved the car. But it's just a big circle. No, oh, I just went backwards. No. It takes you to... It's the other side of the car. So there's really... This is just how you can get back without the car. Okay. Good for that. Good for it. Big deal. Oh no, the game moves sometimes. Game moves sometimes. Oh, bug. <gasps> you wasn't kicked out. Of, you haven't been kicked out of school yet. Well, congratulations. <laughs> you haven't lived unless you have the 24 CD Baldur's Gate. Crap. All right, we have to go do that other thing I didn't want to do, but at least now we've fully explored this back area. You don't have the 24 CD Baldur's Gate, too? Well, forget about it. The hell out of here. Go home. Your year's going well. You have a niece, and she's pretty cool. Yeah, having a niece is a lot cooler than having a daughter. Having a daughter is difficult, let me tell you. Having any child, I assume, is difficult. Every day, you gotta take care of them. You don't get one day off. Let me tell you, think about it before you have a daughter. You're not gonna get anything done. If you have a child, you better get everything you want to get done in your life before you have a child, let me tell you. There was a lot I wanted to get done. Now I can't get it done anymore. Now it's over. My life is over. It's all about taking care of my daughter now. And I tell you, I'm going to remind her about that every single day of her life. Okay, did that change this? No. Okay. I can lower that, and then I can raise that, and then go back around. It's coming back around again. Okay, but now we want to... No, no, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> whoa. I'm going to say things like, you know, if you weren't here, <laughs> I could have been an astronaut. 
CD versions suck. CDs suck. Why did they ever invent CDs? I'm really, I wish they had never invented CDs. I hate having to switch CDs, let me tell you. I'll tell you what. How did this help? Oh. Oh, but we gotta drain this water, man. We're having... Oh, no. Do you think I have to go drain... Do you think I have to go back to whatever that spot was and drain the water? To one of the water draining spots? Maps? No, you need maps to double. This game's very hard. What game has the most CDs? I don't know. What if you wanted to have a child? Did you should have a child before you have a child. This is getting too complicated. I can't think that much. Oh, Snorlax, 10 months. Thank you, Snorlax. Yeah, child used to be useful. You could send him to the coal mines. Oh, I can go up the stairs. You dumb nuts. Go up the stairs. Floppies were cooler. CDs, they're so shiny. Ugh, get out of here. Get out of here. Why did, you, why did they invent those things? Black Dahlia had eight CDs. Okay. Oh, yeah, maybe something like EverQuest. And <laughs> Zip Dicks. Zip Dicks. Zip dicks. Zip dicks. Also zip discs. Master race. Drain the water. Pump it out. Pump it out of here. Get it out of here. Yeah, they should have just... That's loud. They should have just invented Blu-rays or zip discs. Zip, di zip dicks would have been a lot worse than zip discs. Ooh. But I don't know where to what to put here. It's going to be a mess having to go back to all those, huh? Hey, Snorlax, thank you for the sub. Don't copy your floppy. Do copy the zip disk dicks. Zip dicks. So did we drain? It didn't look like any water drained. Does it look like water's drained to you? I mean, we did something. Doesn't look like it drained. We gotta keep pumping? Don't zip your dick. Don't zip your dick, kids. Hey, hive mind. Kids, please don't zip your dick. I don't know, am I pumping it in and out? Now it's going this way. How many times did I hit that? It's going from this pipe. Oh, up. It's go it pumped it pumped something out into something else. Don't zip your dick. <laughs> Use zip discs. If you're a real man, use zip disks. Floppy disks make great sounds. <laughs> so it didn't pump this out. Unless I gotta go unpump that again. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Some of you might not like it. Hey, Skeleton Manners. You've tried it. Uh, I've done it before. I've done it before, too. Here's what we're gonna do. Some of you might not like it. We're doing this. We're gonna save it here, in case I screwed up. Forgot to pay attention again. Pump controls. Back to the game. So now we gotta save here. We go out. It pumps something. It pumps something. We we just gotta follow the pipe around. Follow that pipe. This looks like your job for this game. <laughs> yeah. Well, do you work in a sewage treatment plant? Or are you sewage? It's the real question. I mean, we didn't pump this out. That's all there. I mean, there's a pipe here. Um, there's a pipe here. Let me try to... There's a pipe over here. It's like going from over here. Oh, I think it pumps out. I think I, I, think I have to go back and pump this out and then go down there. Yeah, I think we gotta reload. I think, I, I think we're gonna try that reloading. Are you so Is your job to be sewage? Someone's got to do it. Hey, Evalon. Vitek, I doesn't look like Vitek's here today, or he's not talking in chat. Yeah, we're pumping it out, back, and that's because the. Of course, it's not gonna pump out the water in front of us because the pipe is stick stuck over there. Pay attention. Open your eyes. 
Open your ears. I miss click. I miss clicking too fast. Hey, Strahd. Making meatballs in sauce. Let me tell you. I love it, the meatballs. These are some good meatballs. Yeah, look, we drained it out, baby. You work at a chemical plant. Nice. What do you do there? Hey, have you ever thought about falling into the chemical vats and turning into the Joker? <laughs> it could work. Ooh, a big map. Oh. Ooh. Okay. That's the pump. Ooh. Alright, we're gonna take a picture of this and print it out. I'm gonna take a picture of it on my phone. Wait, what is it showing me? It's showing- there's a bunch of red dots. Ay! Ay, ay, ay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ay! Do I have to go to all those red dots? Who has the time today? What with, uh, you know, all the, all the bad news in the papers? Who has the time to go to all these dots? Now, what is the snipping tool? Because... I don't know how to use the snipping tool, but supposedly that's the best way to... print a print screen. I don't know how to use the snipping tool. I copy and paste in MS Paint. And then I'm gonna print that map on my on my realistic printer. My real printer. Here we go. Print it out. You don't work in the plant, but the plant looks similar to this. Wait. You don't work in the Oh. Like where do you work? Like, are you the security?